Hey, yo. Hey, girl. What, what you got going on? Nothing right now. My grandkid is coming over tonight. Oh, it's been about a week since I seen them. I'm just glad. I'm oh, happy. Oh, them boys, huh? They getting big now, huh? Yes, they gonna be boys girl. now. You know, Skip got busted, right? Now, I don't know about that. Then they ran up on Johnny Boy. Oh, nah, that's messed up. Mm, mm, mm. So you telling me I gotta go 30 minutes out my way to get some dope? Oh, messed up. Unless you know somebody in the hood with a car, man. I don't, somebody in there, but snitching girl. Mm, ain't that a bitch. Mm. Well, uh. I'm, I'm gonna see you later. I gotta go. I'm gonna see you later, girl. Alright, babe. I'm, I'm be careful, Joe. Yeah, yeah, I'll be back. Yeah, I'll be mm. back. Hey, baby. Come on, man. Hey. Hey, baby. Mmm. Mmm. Hey, baby, good. How you doing? Hey. Oh, how you doing? I'm doing good. Good. My mama called you. She should have beat me here by now. Yeah, she did call earlier. She was gonna go pick up one of the boys so they can spend some time with their cousins. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go get dressed. Where your aunt at? Oh, it's in the bedroom on the right hand side of the bed. Did y'all have something to eat? Mm-hmm. What y'all had to eat? Uh, my mom cooked chicken. Y'all had some chicken and bring my grandma no chicken? Uh oh, okay. Oh, I'm about to whoop something. I'm gonna have to whoop somebody. Oh, Lord. Car, you better get all that out. I don't want all that stinking in my car.
fish, you alright? Mm hmm. Sit. Are you Miss Venus? I am. This is a matter concerning your daughters, ma'am. May I come in? Thank you. What did they do now? I'm sorry to say, ma'am, they was in a bad accident. Ma'am, please have a seat. Are they all right? No, ma'am. I'm sorry to say. They were scared on everybody. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. No. 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 Uh -uh. Need... No. No. Uh -uh. We're going to need you to come down and identify the bodies as soon as you can. Mm -hmm. Sorry, ma'am. Day by day. What you gonna do about your boy? I'm trying to figure it out now, Miss Peters. I'm supposed to go to North Carolina next week. My uncle got a business. He said he's gonna give me a job. I know it ain't the best, but I realize I gotta get out of these streets. Well, if the foster care get them, they're gonna split the boys up. And they're not gonna do well without their mothers and their fathers in their lives. I ain't in a position to get them right now, though, Miss Peters. I'm staying with somebody. I don't want to have my son struggling with me. I'm going to help you with food and clothes every chance I get, though. Scotty, you got to do something. Because they ain't going to let no crackhead keep my kids. So what we going to do, huh? What we going to do? How they become our responsibility? They family. 
Look, man, they ain't got nobody else. Well, life is tough sometimes, dang. I can't afford no more kids. I already got three. That's five people in a three bedroom. Look, the last thing we need is them boys going to the system. They find out they stand with grandma and she doing crack, they gone. I don't know what to tell you, Dad. Well, I reached out to everybody who I can reach out to. I guess I'm going to have to step up to the plate. Ah, uh, yeah, I mean, they found me, so. What the heck, man? Hey, A.T. Hey, babe. Sorry about the news. Yeah, dang, I don't know. I don't know what to do, but I'm losing my mind. I'm just trying to stay strong for the boys. I talked to Unc, and I think we're going to be able to work something out. I hope so. I yeah. really hope so. Yeah, so we're going to try to help them get like some school supplies and stuff. So mm -hmm. as long as they need food and clothes, I'm going to make sure I help you with that. Okay? Thank you, dang. I need all the help I can get. Thank you. Love you, Angie. Love you too, baby. Grandma. What, boy? We ain't got nothing to eat. We got something up in here. Not from what I saw. Good morning. Hey, good morning, baby. I'm hungry. What are we going to eat? Uh, let me think. Well, wait, 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 wait. I think it's two packs of noodles in there, and I'll cook those noodles for you. And then tomorrow, I'll go to the grocery store. I think I can do that. Don't you get a check? Hell no, I don't get no check. I wish I did. But first thing Monday morning, Grandma gonna go to see about getting us some food. Good. So how may I help you today? Well, I recently adopted my grandkids because my daughters are deceased. Mm. So I'm just trying to get some type of help. Um, since I'm not working. Okay, that's no problem. What's your name? Nancy Peters. Miss Peters, how many kids are you taking care of? Three. Do you have the adoption papers? No, I don't have them. Okay. Well, we can get the majority of the application completed today, but we would definitely need you to bring in those documents so everything can be reviewed. Well, actually, I, I don't really know where the paperwork is. I misplaced it. Okay, well, we would definitely need that paperwork, Miss Peters. In the meantime, do you have any food? Not really. Okay, well, since we can't complete the application, I will go ahead and get you set up for today's food drop. What's a food drop? Well, we partner with local churches and shelters who have large pantries of donated canned goods and other foods like that. Mm -hmm. And they're actually having a route today, so I'm going to add your address on there. Oh, thank you so much. No problem. Mm -hmm. Hey, is this the Peters residence? Who's asking? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm Reggie. I do deliveries for the church. Oh, you really came? Yeah. Do you need me to take this aside for you, Ms. Peters? I appreciate it if you do. Okay. Let me open the door for sure. you. Alright, here you go, Ms. Peters. Hey, girl, what you got going hey, on? Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. How's the Oh, they doing okay. They miss their mother, though. Oh, yeah, I know. And I miss I my babies, too. Oh, them babies, them babies. Mm. Miss them babies. Oh, I got some dope from real. Oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, uh I don't fuck with him no more. He'll try to get over on you, girl. Mm, mm. Hey, I got some more. <laughs> All he right. Smoke a little. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay. I don't like him, but I like some dope. I know that. Right. <laughs> I 
I get, I get, hey, hey, see you later. Okay, I'll don't be, forget. I'll be back. To talk to you. Okay, stand by in the morning. Sure. And where do you think you going in the morning? I'm in business. Boy, please not try me. They, you know I got these grandkids now, right? And I'm trying to get some kind of income to take care of them. I got you. Oh. What? I just want you to get them some school supplies and stuff like that, like I promised you. I, I told you I was going to look out for you. I appreciate it. I do. I appreciate this day. But, look, I need some real money. <laughs> I'm serious. I mean, I'm just trying to take care of the kids. You know, I got the grandkids, right? Man, I feel you, but auntie, I ain't trying to fall out with you over no little dope. Uh, I mean, I'm not trying to do that. And I'm not trying to lock down the hood or anything like that. I'm trying to take care of these kids. And you know, I don't have no money. I mean, that's three kids. I know it's not your fault. But I gotta take care of these grandkids. Man, it has been dry over here. Yeah, it is dry. I mean, it's no dope nowhere. There's no dope nowhere. You gotta have a car to drive and get some dope now. And plus, you know, hey, I know all the fiends over here. You know I know that. Could make a killing. Alright. We're gonna have to get us a sample run. I'll put together a little package for you and see how you deal with that. But I'm telling you, Auntie, one mistake. That's it. I ain't gonna let you down. I can't let you down. I mean, just give me a chance. I promise. You're gonna see it, Auntie. Thank you, Dad. You dang on tea? Yeah. I got a package for you. Oh, okay. I got you. Come on here. Okay, what the hell I supposed to do with that? I thought you were going to bring it in the bags already. I don't know what to do with it. You don't know how to whip it? No. Let me show you how to whip it. Okay.
Yeah, I'm good with Vitale. I think he can pick up tomorrow. Pick up tomorrow? Yeah, tell Dank to come over here and he can pick up tomorrow. Say no more then. I'll tell him. You be good. Easy. Right. Who is it? Dang. Come on here, babe. Oh, not much, babe. How you doing? Bye. I'll be right back. What's up, y'all? What's up? Hey. Yeah. Y'all ready for school? No. 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 Y'all better quit playing and get that education. Auntie, where you at? Hold on, sir. Have a seat. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Bam. Two, four, six. Eight two, two four six eight three, two four six eight four, two four six eight five. Bam. So what I get? Damn. <laughs> That's you and the boys. Get them some clothes. And yeah, we definitely gonna have to talk for real, ain't you? Okay. <laughs> All right. Smell you later, alligator. Okay. I told y'all I wasn't going to let you down. Keep up the good work. Okay. All right, boy. Bitch right there, man. Yeah, I see her. Huh? Yeah, I see her. Yo, let's get that bitch a knife. <laughs> you wanna get it right now? Right now. Get all the money, all the dope. Nah, tonight ain't the night, dog. What you mean? Ain't nothing but a thing, man. Nah, nah we gonna get her, though. We man. gonna get her. Tonight ain't Fuck the night. Ride out, boy. Hello? 
you doing up so early, ain't she? You know, early bird catches the worm, and I don't play. You know me. Mm, I know that's right. I need more soldiers like you. <laughs> you know, make me fight all these young boys and get some senior citizens up in here. No, nah, no, nah, don't do that. Keep them little boys. They make better gangsters. So what's up? What you calling me for? How them boys doing? Yeah, they good. Um, I'm just trying to get out of this dope shit. Oh, man. I knew you was going to do that. What, you getting cold feet on me? No, nigga. I ain't getting no cold feet. I just don't want to be raising these kids selling dope. They need to know they can do something else. Yeah. But I ain't got nothing right now, ain't he? The food stand full. I already got two people working there. So if I find something else, I'll definitely let you know. Okay? Okay, Dank. Let me know if you get something else in, okay? I got you, I'm find something for you to do, all right? I love you. Love you too. Bye, Dank. So you telling me you got two people working in the food stand and you been promising me for the past couple of weeks? That she was going to help me out? Man, I have to tell A.T. anything to keep the money coming in. That's the only bread flow we got. I promise you, I'll get you somebody at the stand. Just hold it down for me. I'm not finna be slaving and working by myself. Like I said, as soon as I find somebody to help you with the stand, they're going to take care of it. All right. Oh, you love that girl. Shut up, man. Down on the brand of sitting in the tree. K I S S I N G. First comes the love, then comes the marriage, then comes the baby in the baby carriage. Bro, y'all sound so stupid, man. Grandma, boy. What's up, little Jerry? Dwayne. Man, your big ass is always eating. You ever get full? Your little ass always talking. Do you ever shut up? Whatever. We can go play some basketball. Y'all scared or y'all want to play? Chris, go ask Grandma if we can go play basketball. All right. All right, this is how it's going to go. I'm going to be point guard. Mike, you be small for it. Grandma, how long want you? Where you trying to go, Ty? To the park to play basketball with little Jerry and Dwayne. Hey, Grandma. Go oh, hey, Grandma, man. You little bad-ass boy. You probably been cussing all the way over him. No, ma'am. Mm-hmm. Y'all can go. Y'all just make sure y'all get your ass back here for those street lights. Come on. Yes, ma'am. Bye, Grandma. Bye. Say bye, baby. Say see you later. See you later, Grandma. Man, y'all Grandma. Mean as hell. We should have won that game. What happened? Man, I don't know what happened, but we should have won. Not when you stalk a girl. 
Man, I don't throw like no girl you just can't catch. Who told you to point guard when you can't shoot? Man, you can't say that because y'all jealous. That's what it sound like. Boy, ain't nobody jealous of you. Yo, look. Big butt thinks he's back. <laughs> Come on, Ty. So did you enjoy the game? You know I always enjoy seeing you trying to show off. I'm not showing off. I'm just good like that. Well, I don't want to hold you up. Are you sure? I don't mind walking you home. You sure? I don't want them clowning you. I ain't worried about them. I'm worried about you. I don't know what you want. Are you sure? Hey, Tommy. Hey, Sheila. Very little girlfriend. I ain't interested in Sheila. I only got one girl in my mind. Really? That's so sweet. Hey, Mr. Manuel. Hey, how you doing this morning, man? I was just about to come see you, man. You know, it's funny how I always come and see you first. You know why I'm here, right? Yeah, I got you. But look, 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 man. I just need a little bit more time, man. Look, this is all the money to my name right now, man. Hey, Man, this is only eighty-six dollars. I got you. You owe me six hundred, man. I got you. I, got you. I hear that all the time, you know man. I got you, man. I always got you, bro. Look, Pookie. Just need a little... Pokey, it's Pokey, man. Pokey, Pookie, whatever. Look, I gave you time, man, because you got a pregnant woman up in there. But look, you wearing out your welcome. I'm telling you. I'm gonna give you until 6 a.m. tomorrow morning. Not tomorrow afternoon or tomorrow night. Tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. If you don't have my money, I am gonna come, I'm gonna pack your shit up and get it out of here. I mean, enough is enough. Oh, Mr. Manuel, all that ain't necessary, man. I got you, bruh. I said what I said because I'm tired of waiting. 6 a.m. tomorrow morning. All right, man. I, I got you, man. And thank you, man. Income takes time. <laughs> I hear that. Girl, you done turn your life around 360. Thank you, girl. With the help of God and these kids. <laughs> Amen. 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 I don't waste a lot of my time. And I got a lot to catching up to do now. What's up, Auntie? Oh, you need me to come over there tonight? Okay, I'll come in the morning. I love you too. All right. Please don't kill us. Please don't kill us. Please don't kill us. 
Please don't. 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 Please Fuck was that, nigga? What the fuck you do? What you mean, man? Man, fuck that bitch, man. Nigga, I told your ass about getting high before we do a lick. Man, nigga, fuck that bitch. She gangsta just like me and you. Man, god Shit. damn, this mother fuck, man. man, she had kids, motherfucker. Man, fuck that bitch, man. Fuck them kids. The nigga, man, fat. Nigga, what? <laughs> Tomorrow's right. No. Tyrone get out tomorrow. Really? Oh dang, I forgot all about cuz. Yo, we need to throw some type of barbecue or get together for him. You sure he gonna wanna do that though? Like he just got out. Man, cuz been locked up all these years. I'm pretty sure he wanna come home to his family or gathering and get together or something. Mm -hmm. Hey, let's go by uh, Mike Nim house. do you do, nigga? All you do is smoke weed all day and play video games. And? And do some fucking constructive like get a damn job or something. Can you at least get the door or is that shit too hard for you to do too? You smell like a marijuana dungeon up in here, though. Whatever, man. What you doing on my side time anyway? Man, you know what tomorrow is, right? Nah, what? Ty get out tomorrow, man. What? Damn, I forgot all about that, bro. I think we need to do a little get-together or something for him. That's cool. How much it gonna cost, though? Shit, I don't know how much it's gonna cost, but that's the least we could do for a nigga that been locked down. All these grimy-ass women, you know, I know we can get some food stamps. Alright, I'm gonna see what I can do. I'll let you know. Alright. So what's up, girl? You thought this man ain't gonna be a fool over yet? No, I'm gonna tell him when the time is right. I was just cussing this fool out before y'all got here. What happened? Ever since Mike lost his job, girl, he ain't been the same. He drinking more, he smoking more. And then the unemployment check, bitch, that shit just ain't cutting no more. Hell, he smoking most of that shit up. Oh, I am. One after the other, running up out this bitch. Mm, girl, like, I hope you and Mike get it together. Like, because I love y'all. I love you too. But if I'm going to do bad, I'm going to do bad all by my damn self. Okay? I know that's right, girl. Baby, you hear me? Yes. <laughs> get that shit together. Man, no, nigga, no, I know no. you did not throw a 20, bro. It's I nothing did, but 50s I, down here, bro. I, I, you I, I throw a 20. 20. 20. I'm going to take your little 20. I'm going to take your little 20. Take your little 20. Sock money. Let me show you how this shit go, dog. Let me go ahead. 
Zigzag, man. <laughs> What's up, my brother? Hey, huh? Shit up, man. And y'all gotta stop coming around here, yo. Whoa, whoa. Oh. What? Stop coming around here? Why is that? Huh? Man, they yell. And they putting you in body bags. <laughs> oh, shit, here we go. <laughs> they putting us in body bags. Nah, brother. But they putting yeah. you in body bags. But enough entertainment for today. Look, we need all the information you can get us on a G Man. Same way you did last time. I, I can't get you shit on G Man. I ain't never seen G-Man touch no dope. Mm. He's just a boss and a cool-ass dude. Uh, look here, man. Here. I'm sure if you try hard enough, you can find something. Work your magic like you did last time, because remember why you ain't locked up right now. I ain't got to remember, because you ain't going to never let me forget. <laughs> Damn straight. <laughs> Here you go. Thanks, sweetheart. You're welcome. Hi, I'm Ashley Williams from Channel 4 Atlanta. Here reporting on the ongoing carjackings and gang activity heavily on the south side of Atlanta in areas of College Park, Forest Park, and East Point. In the last few months, crime activity has drastically escalated. Some blame the street gang G20 soldiers and their affiliates for the gang and drug activity. Mayor Davis is organizing a drug and gang task force in an attempt to take the street back for the community. Back to you, Ken. What's up, babe? I just can't figure it out. Like, the world has so much to offer. Yeah. We as a people, all we do is smoke dope, gang bang. It makes, it makes no sense. Well, I mean, you know what they say. If you knew better, you do better. That's all those kids know. That's not an excuse, baby. Look at all the stuff that I've been through. I know, baby, but you made it out. You were strong. Mike and Tyrone not even as strong as you. Yeah, I guess you're right. Damn, boo pad, that shit shot your ass be hogging and weed. You ain't even put in on this nigga. I'm just saying, though. I broke motherfuckers. I always just be saying, that. yeah, man. Big Mike, how you feeling? I'm good. I'm good. My brother coming home tomorrow. Hell yeah, big time coming home tomorrow. So we partying tomorrow too? Yeah, we cooking tomorrow. My cousin house. I'm gonna see y'all the address so y'all can fall through. Cool. Show. Matter of fact, I need to hit the ATM, boo. Pull up to the store, let me get some money out for the night and tomorrow. Cool, I got you. Matter of fact, pull up right here and we'll run in the store real quick. Cool, cool, I got you. Hey, I need to give you some gum. I got you, I. You sure? I got you. Ice, right, so what's been good, my dog? Same old shit, Shard. I need to get me a fucking job. What's the hold up, nigga? I got a record longer than motherfucking Beaufort Highway. What's up with Kat? She don't hang out with us no more. Fine ass. I had to keep her away from your ass. I ain't gonna have to fuck you up, boo. Man, tell her I asked about her. Alright. Oh, shit! Oh, what the fuck? Hey, you got my gun, nigga? Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> you headed to the jail? Yeah. I'll call you later. Okay. Love you too.
Big time. What's up, Ken Cole? What's up, June Bugs? Good to see you, sir. Hey, good to see you too, cuz. I know you're ready to get up out of here. Oh, man. Come on. That's roll, baby. Right, let's roll. How you doing? Hey, to see Miss Miller. Good morning. Just sign in and take a seat. She'll be right there. Yes, sir. Miller, another one for you. Thank you. Tyrone Peters, come on back. Hi, Mr. Peters, I'm Miss Miller. Have a seat. I read your file, Mr. Peters, and I see you served a few years for shooting someone that broke into your house. Yes, ma'am. You might not be able to tell, but I ain't even that type of guy. I truly believe you, Mr. Peters. Besides this, your record was clean as a whistle. If you don't mind me asking, what happened? I was laying down asleep with my baby mother, and I heard my daughter call my name. It's my turn, baby. I got it. Hey, baby, what's up? You all right? Mother! Hey! Hey, yo, bro. I give you whatever you want, man. Just don't hurt my babies. How much more can I hurt some of Please, bro. Please. I give you whatever, man. Just don't hurt my babies, man. Hurry up, baby. You got five seconds. Five, five seconds, seconds here. Hey, baby, don't say a don't word, say please. That. Don't say that. Yeah, man, Hurry up. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Hey, that's my whole wallet, man. And my cash and my credit cards. That's everything I got in my name, bro. Please, man. Please. And then you broke his nose. Yes, ma'am. I ain't even mad at you, Mr. Peters, and I'm not the judge. But to me, you a man doing what you're supposed to do. Thank you, Miss Miller. I'm not even going to harass you. You just have to promise me that you stay out of trouble, get a job, come see me once a month, and pay your fine, and in six months, all this will be over. I definitely will. Here you go. Sign this. It's nice, cuz. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Get up out of here. Shit, what up, bro? What up, though, nephew? Chill, chill. What you doing, man? Alright, alright, alright. What up, though, fellas? Uh, how y'all boys doing? Yeah, yeah, man, you know, right. I'm gonna tell y'all, man, it's a pleasure doing business with y'all fellas. You know what I'm saying? But listen, man, it's a lot of money out here. You niggas gotta understand, man. All of us can eat. But you niggas got to understand the rules to this game. Number one, you got to be about that motherfucking action. Uh, right? Yeah, right? 100. You got to stay true to the game, and you niggas got to be loyal to this motherfucking family. You dig what I'm saying? Oh, Lord, my nigga, I ride for this motherfucker. And another thing, let me tell y'all something, man. 
gangsters move in silence. You niggas got to learn to be discreet. I ain't no motherfucking Nino Brown and ain't now one of you niggas no motherfucking rappers. So all that wild, flashy, wild shit, we don't get down like that. I'm going to tell y'all right now, dog. I'm trying to be rich, stay rich, and be up under that motherfucking radar. You got to have them killer too, bro. You got to have them killer, man. man. Who in the fuck is you, dog? They call me Diesel, bitch, dog. I ride for my nigga, man. I kill anybody. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You'll kill anybody for me, nigga? I'll kill a kid. I don't give a fuck. What? Uh, yeah. Nigga, you'll do what? I will kill a kid. Out, I don't man. give a Check fuck. Fuck your life fucked up. Man. Another dead soul, right, Bill? Let me tell you niggas something. See, I can't get no money with niggas like this. These are the kind of motherfuckers that are how you locked up in prison forever. <laughs> Dig what I'm saying? Let's throw this motherfucker in the Chattahoochee. Nephew, I'm going to get at you, man. Let these niggas know what the fuck going on, dog. Let's get the fuck on, man. Let's roll. What up, dog? Yo, up. Hey, man. You couldn't talk to me before you made a decision about my soldiers? Man, I'ma tell you something, nigga. That's your job to check for them niggas, man. Man, I hear you, Unc. Well, that was the mayor's son, man. It was about to get us in the game, Unc. Man, I wouldn't give a fuck if that was the president's son. The next time that shit happen, nigga, it's gonna be you and that motherfucker. Matter of fact, man, get the fuck on, man. Hey, don't worry about that. I know who you're exactly who you are. Give me a few seconds, man. Yeah. Give me a second. Right. Brenda! Hey. Hey, Tyron. Hey, I don't mean to intrude, but um, I didn't have your number. I just want to let you know that I was out um, maybe a day or two throughout the week. I can come see the kids. I don't have a problem with that. And once I get a job, I will definitely be helping you out again. I really appreciate that, Tyron. And for the record, I... Can I see the kids? One minute. Thank you. Daddy! Hey, babies. Oh, I've missed you so much, Daddy. Yeah, hey, I miss y'all too. Everything's been good? Yeah, everything's been good, Daddy. I mean, it, you know how it is right here. Ain't nothing changed. Well, how you doing, little man? Good. How you been? I'm all right. How's your mama and new boyfriend is? Johnny, he all right, Daddy. I mean, him and mama argue every now and then, mm -hmm. but other than that, you cool. All right, good. That mean I ain't got to be coming over here acting a fool then. <laughs> uh, what you guys doing next Friday? Nothing. Well, I'm going to come get y'all guys so we can hang out. What time? Uh, let's do 12 or 1. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm ready to see y'all guys. Here's my number, Daddy. Okay. Just call me, okay? Cool. Well, y'all give me a hug. All right, love you, little man. Love you, Princess. Love you too, Daddy. See you Friday. All right, see y'all Friday. Right. Hey, you want to see us, Lieutenant? Yeah, come on in and have a seat. Yeah, I need you guys' help with this G20 soldier situation. Uh, you guys are my best detectives, and uh, you know the streets like the back of your hand. Your brass is coming down on me, man. They want to know what we're doing about it. Hmm. Hell, I'd like to know what we're doing about it. Well, you definitely asked the right people. <laughs> Right about so that. what you got in mind, Lieutenant? What we'd like to do, we've got some names here. Uh, now, this is not the big fish. These are not the big fish, but uh, they could definitely lead us in the right direction. All right, well, I'll tell you this, Lieutenant. We're going to be right on it. Right. We have the right man for the job. All right. That we will. Right. Appreciate work. it. All right. Let me know. All right. Yes, sir. Yeah. 
come check me out. See you. Man, take that bag off, man. Zigzag, aka Morris Weston. What's up, nigga? Gee, I can explain everything, man. Bet he can. <laughs> oh, you got shit to explain now, nigga? Alright, explain this shit to me. I got jammed up on that Florida run. I was finna give me some hard times, G. You know I just had a little baby? Yeah. You sure did, did he? You know I want to do shit to bring down the family, man. What I got going on ain't got shit to do with us. I want to snitch on you, man. You should have to choose between this family and that family, huh? I'm sorry, G. Yeah, I'm sorry too, Ziggs, man. You know, man. Lord, please forgive me for my sins and the sins of my brother Ziggs, man. I ask that you watch over his family and welcome to your castle, boy. Hey, girl, what you been up to? I'm nine, just waiting on this little young nigga come bring me some weed. Oh, smoking. Girl, my nerves always bad, but shit, I just got this new job. I ain't finna get tested, so. I guess that's smart. <laughs> Stacy. What? You fucking with them boys from G20? Uh, no. I mean, I don't mess with no gangbangers. Tripping, them niggas cool. They finna have a party this weekend. Mm, nah, you can have that. I ain't trying to get shot. <sighs> Same old scary Stacy. Shit changed. Hey, what's up, ma? Damn, nigga, where the fuck you been? All over the world or some shit? Hey, don't worry about all that. Chicken my money. You know your ass don't like to pay. Whatever. Shit. Shut the fuck up, nigga. I'm in my shit. Shit, that. Hey, who your homegirl is? Trap, I'm gonna tell you right now. She don't fuck with dope boy, so take your ass on. All right, you have a good day anyways. Thank you. Young ass. Ain't you too young to be selling dope? Stacy, they be younger than that around here. That's the projects. What's up, cuz? What's up, man? I'm chilling, man. Hey. Yo, man, I really appreciate everything you done did for me, man. But you don't got to take me to dinner, man. Man, I'm just happy to see you, cuz. I don't mind treating you. You family, man. Plus, we about to go pick up your brother, too. Man, you know what? I've been calling that man all day, bro. I ain't even getting no answer. Are you sure that? I know you said you weren't feeling good earlier, but he'll be ready by the time we get there. <laughs> man, you know my brother, bro. Yeah. Hey, where's Chanel at? I think she's working. Okay. Okay. I'm ready. All right, all right. Time to roll. Something? Nah. Surprise! What's up, bro? Uh, mm -hmm. 
<laughs> What's good? Hey, no, man. Let's get this party started. Hey, let's get it, baby. Especially when Brenda stopped writing. You were definitely a lifesaver. Oh, you telling me that my scribble scrabble made you feel a certain kind of what? Hey, it helped me get through shooting. You are definitely a true friend. You've been a good friend as well. You know, one kindness deserves another, right? You right. I'm sure if I was locked up, you'd be there for me too. I will. I hope so. Well, I gotta get going. And again, welcome home. I'm glad to be back. Hey, thank you for coming out. Hey, hold up. Text Yanni and let me know you made it home. Yanni? Yeah, I gotta get him on the phone. Gotcha. Will do. Good night. Good night. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, woo! Good morning, cousin. Good morning, cousin. Hey, man, I really enjoyed myself last night. Man, me too, man. I had a good time. Man, I tell you. Where you headed to? Man, I gotta find a job. I gotta start over. Car crib. Getting things for my kids, bro. Yeah. I'm on a mission right now, man. So, oh, I'm gonna put your number on my application, too. Yeah, that's cool. All right, you going there with the train station? Yeah, come on, I'll drop you off. All right. Hey, I'm gonna um, talk to Mr. Nate today for you, too. All right, appreciate that. All right. So what we got, brother? We got Ryan Wright, a.k.a. Chopper. Job. Let's see. Threats, back and forth disputes with his girl. Yeah, that's it. Unfortunately, that's all we got on this piece of shit, man. But uh, he's G20 affiliated. Alright. Oh, hold on. It's bigger than motherfucking devil right there. You see him? Alright. How about this? Let's we'll see if we can scare Mr. Chop a little bit. Yeah? How about this? Let's do it. Bro, just stay back, man. Man, I, come on, man. It's, been, hey, it's bro, me, man. Don't walk up on me, dog. What the fuck you talking about, man? It's been a while, man. What How the fuck mean, you been? Come here, man. Get on you. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Fuck, man. Fuck. Yeah. This one ain't gonna miss, bro. <laughs> hey, it's just us out here, no yeah. witnesses. Just one of this bucket, right? You know, it's fucked up. Hey, it's just us, man. No witnesses. Fucked up. The pop you are gonna get away with, man. Hey Chris. Hey Sheila, how you doing? Good, how are you? I'm good. So what can I help you with today? Chris, my car has not had an oil change or tune up in about a year. Wow. My car needs some love. That's terrible. So where you leave your keys at? <laughs> oh, I left them in the car. Alright. If you go this way and have a seat in the lobby, and I'll get back with you. Okay. Hey, I enjoyed y'all's welcome home party last night. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for the invite. Alright. This is Mr. Nate. Really? Last night? Okay. Appreciate the info. All right, thanks. Damn. What's going on, Mr. Nate? Oh, I just got off the phone and just got advised there was some break-ins. Somebody got robbed, they broke into the place and spray painted G20 all over the place. Police, they can't stop these fools. They're gonna keep on messing around with the wrong somebody's. It's gonna be over. 
All right, Sheila, you got everything done, got all your floors topped off, ready to go. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. What's up? Um, can I ask you a question? Yeah, sure. Is Tyrone coming home to someone? I mean, are you starting over or what? I honestly think he's starting over. I'm not trying to bounce back and get back on his feet. Why? You got the house for Tyrone? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I always like Tyrone. We always been close, you know that. Yeah. You know, I just don't want to rush him to anything. You won't. Just keep being that good friend that you are. I mean, that's what he really needs in his life right about now. Okay, I appreciate that. All right. All right, thanks, Chris. All right. All right. Come again. We'll do. All right, See you later. Hey, listen, we could care less about your little misdemeanor track record. We don't want you. All we want is information. <laughs> I ain't telling y'all shit. Y'all niggas can kiss my ass. This guy. That's right. Come on. Look, let me teach you a little something about loyalty that you haven't learned yet. Do yourself a favor, because right now, you looking out for somebody who don't give a damn about what happens to you. How you think you got here? Nigga, you don't know shit about me. What? We don't know shit about you. We know enough to get you in here. Shit. <coughs> we know you wanted for terroristic threats. What? You trying to scare a little bitch skank of yours, man? Huh? Like a real and woman. so many other motherfucking things. Scared little bitch. <laughs> Ryan? Listen. Chair, here nigga, y'all can't prove shit. We can't prove shit? No, you can't prove shit. And I ain't got shit else to say. Shit, you look at this motherfucking camera here. Yeah, I'll take your ass down, hey, right? Hey, hey, hey. Are you kidding What's me? What's going on here? Uh, What's going on? What does it look like, yes. Mr. Ryan? Yes, sir. Don't you say another word. Yes, sir. What you got there, attorney? My client has applied for bail. Oh, my God. Okay, Lieutenant, tell so him that we've already the handcuffs him. off of him now. And he can go on about his way. Looks like we're going to have to let him go, guys. You see that? <laughs> now, let's go. You, just, you heard the man. You trying to say this piece of shit? <laughs> This enjoy, enjoy seriously? while you can. Yeah, yeah. Crazy. yeah. Speed oh. up, John Legend. <laughs> <laughs> Do I smell alcohol in your breath, Detective? Oh, it's not as fucking thick on your breath. Yeah, yeah. Watch, you watch your saw. mouth. Watch my mouth? Appreciate it. Let me tell you something, man. I'm coming for you, boy. I'm coming for you. Yeah, I bet. Hey, Look, you got that bad. Right? Yeah? Yeah, I'll take this damn bag. Hey, I'll Lieutenant. Right now and we'll take see you, down. you later. <laughs> so <soon. Suckers. laughs> Mr. Kingsley. Gee, good to see you again. Good to see you, man. Thank you. I really appreciate what you do for me. What are friends for? Take care of Mr. Kingsley for me. Go. Everything look good? Not bad. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> You have a good night, Mr. Kinsey. Gene, good to see you, man. You take care. Well, Mr. Kinsey, to the car. I got him. Chopper, good to see you. Thanks. Let's go, Mr. Kinsey. Yo, man. Appreciate it, G. No, you already know. Man, all they did was ask me questions about you, man. About me? Yeah, man. They say I'm small fish. They say they want that whale. Is that so? Yeah, man. But you know, I ain't tell them niggas shit. But hey, some niggas out here dry snitching on you, man. Time to make examples of these fools, boy. What up, man? What feel with you, little homie? Not much cooler, man. I got a mission for you, though. What's up? Say, the east side boy making a lot of bread on they side, man. Hit that bit easily. What? Them niggas getting it like that? Hell yeah, yeah, that's what Yolanda say. Hit ain't security week too. Mm. Yeah. Nigga, I'm with it, nigga. I need a quick come up, nigga. I need the bread right now anyway, nigga. Let's get him. What's up? Hey, come in. How's it going, Mr. Nick? Hey, Chris, what's going on? Good. This is uh, my cousin Tyrone. It's Mr. Nate. How you doing, Mr. Nate? Tyrone, how you doing? I'm doing good. Can't complain. So, what all can you do? I can do the basics, like oil changes, tune-ups, brakes, alternators. If you got room, I wouldn't mind hanging around, so I'll show you what I can do. Maybe even clean up or something. I even brought some extra clothes with me. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do it.
wardrobe. Remember when we went shopping the other day? Mm -hmm. I bought one dress and stole three. Really? <laughs> you slick girl. But don't be doing that with me. I'm trying to be somebody. Yeah, right. I'm going to be somebody tonight when I put my new outfit on. <laughs> Niecy the queen of Magic City. Hey, baby, if that's what you want to call me, just make sure you have them dollars thrown on me, too. <laughs> okay, then, twerk queen. <laughs> I think that's G-Man over there. Let me introduce you. Hey, G-Man. Yeah, they're all coming. Hey, what's up, girl? Where the hell you been hiding at? Nowhere, just hibernating, trying to stay out of trouble. Who's your friend? I'm Stacy. I'm G-Man. Nice to meet you, G-Man. This is all mine. I got the group text about the party tomorrow. Oh, no doubt. And <laughs> hey, make sure you fall through too, all right? We'll be there. All right. Make sure you bring me Stacy with you. We'll be there. All right, I'm gonna let y'all. I can't go to a dope dealer's party, girl. My mom would kill me. But did you see all the money he had, though? Girl, that's why I don't be messing around with no schoolboys. I need me a man with some real money, girl. A nice ride and a nice bank account. A bitch be needing some things. Well, a bitch need to sew her ass down. Them G20 boys are dangerous, girl. They always end up either dead or in jail. Girl, bye. All you do is got me ripping and running all day. Oh. Baby, you want some back? No, I'm okay. What the fuck? I can't wait to see you tonight, babe. Damn. All right, baby, let's ride. Hey, I just wanted to tell you a good job today, son. Thank you. I'm going to go ahead and put you on the schedule. You just come on in with Chris tomorrow, and then we'll start you off on a part-time basis, and then put you on full-time schedule as the work picks up. Thank you so much, Mr. Nate. No problem. See you in the morning. Yes, sir. You ready? Yeah, cuz. And Mr. Nate gave me a job. Uh, I knew that was gonna happen. I yes. knew he was gonna put you on. Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, hold on right quick. Hello? Hey, Chris. Hey, Sheila. What you up to? Nothing much. Just want to know if you can do me a little favor. All right, what's that? Yeah, can you have Tyrone call me when he get a chance? <laughs> hey, I can do you one better than that. Hold on. Hello? Hey, you. Hey, Sheila, how you doing? I was calling to see if, you know, you had plans tonight. No, I'm just trying to get back right, you know, before I can start enjoying myself like I really want to. <laughs> I understand. But listen, you have been nothing but a good friend to me. And I am not a gold digger, so I can, I can afford to take a friend out. You sure? Yes, come on. Okay. Give me about an hour. All right. I'm <laughs> gonna get my man. <laughs> Ty, you know this dude? Man, your big ass always eating, man. Don't you ever get full? <laughs> Yo, Lil Jerry, how you been, man? Man, I been good, man. How you been? Well, you ain't Lil Jerry no more. You big Jerry now. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Man, but how you been, though, man? I ain't no, even know you was out. Yeah, I just got out, man. Just trying to make it. Shit, I feel you on that one. Well, hey, man, I see you about to wrap up and everything, man. I ain't gonna hold you. I'll be in my car right here on Monday. I'll chop it up with you then. All right, bro. All right, man. Be easy. All right, man. All right, man. All right, man. Let's get this money. No stupid shit, bro. Man, in and man. out. Man, fuck in all that, out. man. We finna get these niggas. Fuck this shit, man. Here we go. Who the fuck is it? Who is it? Fuck the money, nigga. Where the fuck are you? Got it, fam. Got it, fam. Got it. Ice. 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 Oh, 
get up, dog. Come on, Ice. man. Get up, dog. Ice. Freedom. I miss my family. And I missed all the sexiness right there. <laughs> I missed you too. Let's go have a seat. <laughs> you know, I cannot believe what Brenda did to you. Yeah, I know, right? You know, I really thought we had something special. You did, Ty. I mean, you're an excellent father. I remember I used to watch you guys as a big family. I used to pray to God to send me a good black man like you. Hey, thank you, Shiva. And you're just the same beautiful and sexy. I'm curious, how are you single, girl? <laughs> I'm picky, Ty. <laughs> you know, I'm just waiting for someone special. Mm -hmm. I'm just waiting for my Mr. Right. All right. How you gonna know who Mr. Right is? It wasn't hard to tell. Good morning. Good morning, babe. You have some time? I can make you some breakfast. 
Nah, no thank you, Sheila. You've been generous enough. You know I like you, and uh, I don't want to make it seem like I'm using you, you know? Nigga, <laughs> you just got out of jail, mm -hmm. and you broke. You got to use somebody. You right. <laughs> but maybe you can come back after, and uh, I'll cook you some dinner. Definitely, definitely. I'm going to go spend some time with my kids, and then I'll be back later to kick it with you. You gonna put something sexy on the line? <laughs> you know I am. All right. <laughs> What's that? I'm not trying to keep tabs on you. I have an extra car that I let my family use when they come to town. Mm -hmm. So you're welcome to use it. But um, wait a minute, is your license valid? Of course, yeah. Well, you can use it if you like. Hey, thank you, baby. You're the best. <laughs> no problem. Unless you got some other funny business going uh, <laughs> on. Nah, nah. You know. All right. <laughs> Man, what would I do without you? Nothing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm going to go get dressed on. Uh, I'll be back shortly. Okay. What's up, girl? Hey, boo. You okay? Mm -hmm. I miss him already. Mm -hmm. He's gonna be so mad when he wake up and see I'm gone. Well, at least he know you're serious. Uh-huh. But it's serious enough to make him want to change? Me knowing Mike? I hope so. But what I do know is he gonna want to be in his child's life, though. Have you told him yet? Girl, I wanted to, but he is not ready, Yanni. Mm -mm. You never gonna know? Don't make it up. So, you seen the news last night? No. They called it armed robbery that went bad. Damn, I feel bad I lost my partner, bro. Man, I feel fucked up too, man. But you know that's them niggas that fucking shot his brother, though. That's why that nigga think he's one of his ass Yeah, but still, man. He always had to do some extra shit, bro. Hey, you know what? Hold up, boom, call you back. Yeah, hit me back, man. Good, huh? Nothing. I'm good, man. <laughs> I can see that. You on there smiling like you about to take a picture. Must have had a good night last night. Yeah, it was cool, man. I got a job, a loving family, a bad chick that's into me, you know? <laughs> I'm just really feeling blessed, man. Man, I'm really happy for you, cuz. You and Sheila must be really kicking it, huh? Yeah, you know what I mean? I'm not trying to rush into anything. Why not? Man, she got her shit together. She ain't got no kids. That's the definition of a lady, man. Plus, she already had a crush on you. She gave me her loaner phone and let me use her extra car. <laughs> Damn, you must have licked that thing all night last night. Nah, nah. You know, she know I'm going to go see the kids later. Plus, um, she cooking dinner, so, you know, I'm going to be out of here a little early today. All right, cuz. Well, enjoy yourself, man. All right, cuz. Will do, man. All right. Oh, let's go. 
going on, man? Hey, man, That's, what's up? You got a minute? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm Johnny, man, by the way. Hey, Tyrone, man, nice to meet you. Man. Yeah, man, I just want to tell you, man, you did a great job with the kids. Uh, it's good to see you come around, man. Appreciate it. Because these are pretty bright kids, man. Pretty bright kids. Yeah, man. they are. Very bright, very bright, man. Uh, you did an excellent job, man. Hey, thanks, man. Thanks. Hey, you know what, man? I appreciate you real talk for stepping up being the man while I've been locked up, man. Hey, too many men won't be doing what you're doing, so I appreciate that, man. Hey, thanks. Thanks again, man. Let me wrap it to those. All right, appreciate that. Hey, Dad. Hey, son. What's it been up to? Nothing. Just wait till Friday so I can see you. All right, I've been waiting too, man. Hey, Dad. Hey, sweetie. How you been doing? Good. Dad, you got a car already? No, that's a friend of mine. Car. I'm just using it for the day. Oh, okay. All right, y'all come on. So where are we going, Dad? Oh, can we go to Six Flags with the zoo? Uh, not this week, son. My money's still kind of funny. Oh, How about we do the park, and then we just catch up, you know? All right, that's cool. <laughs> All right. I miss y'all guys. Let's get out, bro. Let's hit up a strip club or something. No, I'm good, boo. Go ahead and enjoy yourself. Mm. Nah, you ain't good, bro. You don't lost your homie and your girl all in the same fucking day. I'm scared right now, man. Yo, who is it? Chris. Whew. What's up, man? What's up, bro? Glad to see you. Me too. Sorry to talk to you, cuz, man. All right. I'm going to be back, all right? All right, I'll catch you later. All right. So, Yo, you look like you about to kill somebody, man. You all right? Yeah, I'm good, cuz. I can't believe she just up and dipped on me like that, though, cuz. Man, she ain't up and dip nowhere, man. She just wants you to do better for yourself. You gotta get up out these streets and raise your family. Every time her phone rings, she thinks something happened to your ass. Man, you gotta try to do something different, dog. Hey, baby. Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? How you doing? I'm good. I just went to go see Mike. Yeah? Yeah. How's he doing? Bad man. Mike always think the whole world is against him. Like ever since our mothers died, and then our grandma got killed and going from foster home to foster home. Just did something to him. Well, you and Tyrone do the same thing. Yeah, but everybody not cut the same. Hmm. What you working on? <sighs> Just some finances and going over our budget. <laughs> My baby in the county. I mean, I know we ain't rich, but it sure feel good not having the eviction notice on that door. Hey, Mom. Hey, baby. Did you have a good time? Yeah, Dad says he's going to pick us up next Friday. Okay, then. Okay. Hey, Mom. Hey, baby. Did you enjoy yourself? Yes, we had such a good time, Mom. I just love Dad's determination and how he don't let none get him down and he don't let none stop him. Yeah, he's a good man. And he loves you guys so much. Yeah. Hey, Mom, can I go to Yaya house tonight? Please. Why do you want to spend the night at Yaya's house? You know I can't stand that fast-ass girl. She's young-minded and immature. I know, but so her mom's going to have a small kid together, and she's going to take us to breakfast in the morning, and she's going to pick me up so you don't even have to try. Okay, just this one time. And do not make this a habit. Yes, ma'am. Love you. See you later. Girl, you came out tonight and you in a good mood. What's going on? I hung out with my dad today, girl. I'm just so glad he's home. It's ridiculous. I heard your dad was a beast, girl. My uncle said even your grandma was a gangster. And I ain't trying to be funny. I mean, everybody says that. But I've never seen dad be anything but a gentleman. And he's respectful. Well, I ain't make that shit up. You heard the same thing I heard. Grandma was getting it. <laughs> well, I wish you would have left me some, man. <laughs> you want a drink? Nah, I'm good. Come on, it ain't gonna kill you. No, I'm straight. I don't want nothing to drink. Okay. It's good. What is it? Don't worry about it, 
drink up. It's free. See, there you go. <laughs> Come on, we gotta go get Yaya, and we gotta get this stupid party. All right, girl. Somebody in there right now. yourself, boo. We didn't know that stupid motherfucker would do that. I've been right before Nisi. I feel her pain just like it happened to me. My uncle know her daddy. I know he ain't scared of G-Man. I'm gonna tell him what's up. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> Boy, when you get your car fixed by black folks, you know it's gonna take all damn day. Yo, Big J. What's up, man? I'm alright, man. Hey, I need to talk to you. What's up? Yo, I got a call from my niece earlier today, and... She alright? Yeah, she all right, but she talking about she went to a party with your daughter last night. Stacey didn't mention nothing about a party. Because it's on G20 niggas party, man. They raped your daughter, bro. What? Yeah, man, word out here on the street, like, she don't even want you to know, man. Like, she don't even want you to get in trouble no more. Look, nigga named G-Man. He the G little leader of them little G20 niggas. G-Man? Yeah, I'm sorry, man. Okay. I'm sorry, man. Stacy, just say yes or no. <laughs> I love you. So what you know about them G20 boys, Jerry? Man, everything y'all need to know, man. Like, my little cousin be running with no boys, man. He talking about they getting money. They ain't even nothing like that. All they do is just banging, really. And only a few of them really be flipping that paper like that, you know? So are they just like a big ass army? Man, man hell yeah, man. They on the G20 shit hard out here, man. Like all these little niggas brainwashed out here, especially my little cousin. All he do is talk about weed, money, and they little G20 parties. But I heard two of their spots, though, be bumping. Like they move shit in books right out the door. 
One nigga serving, two niggas playing secured. So sound them niggas can be touched. Shit, yeah, that's what it sound like. Yeah. And hell yeah. He got a little chief commander named G Man. You know he talking cash shit because he got niggas backing him up. Real nigga in charge is an uncle named Pokey. Pokey? Pokey. Yeah. OG gangster. And word around town is that that same nigga killed your grandma. Don't mind me, guys. Who is she, bro? Oh, this is my homegirl, Cat, man. She cool. You hitting it? Nah, nah. That's my homeboy, Ice Girl, man. Your homeboy, Ice? Yeah. And she's staying here. Yeah. Where that nigga at? I just got killed a couple days ago, man. Well, my bad. Plus, I love Chanel anyway. I'm trying to get my shit back right, bro. Smart move, cuz. Proud of you. Hey girl, I'm good. Yeah, I'm here for a few days. Look, I know he has something to do with killing Ice, and I'm damn sure gonna find out. Yeah, they talking G-Man business now. All right, I'll keep you posted, bye. You nigga! I'm gonna be over there later. <laughs> Shit, I know what you want. Hey, hold on real quick. Yo, what up? You gonna answer his phone? Alright, hold on. Long G. Yo. What? Man, look. Tell everybody if anybody has any information, man, that I get them $10,000. No, fuck that shit. Look, I get them $20,000 for them, alright? Shit, let's go, man. Let's go. Fuck. Fuck.
fuck my money up. Give you shit. Oh, you're a tough guy now, huh? <laughs> All right. I'm gonna ask you one more motherfucking time. What the fuck my money up? Fuck. You good, bro? Nah, cuz. Not until I get this G-Man, nigga. Man, that shit on the way, man. We're gonna keep to our everyday routine. But he our next target. Alright. Alright, man. Chris, Ty. What's up, Mr. Nate? What's up, Mr. Nate? I need to talk to y'all. I don't know how to tell you all this. I just got a phone call. Saying they murdered your brother. What? Mike? <sighs> Fuck! Girl, what you over there snacking? <laughs> that pregnancy crazy is kicking your ear and all. Girl, you know I always see it. I always see it. Ashley Williams from Town of Fort Atlanta. Earlier today, authorities found the body of Michael Peters in woods surrounding the College Park area. Sources say he was murdered execution style. His body was discovered by a local neighbor out walking his dog. They came upon the remains of Michael Peters. At this point, College Park authorities have no lead. <laughs> We'll be bringing you information as this tragic story unfolds. I'm Ashley Williams. Yo, man, I'm hearing all these motherfucking rumors, dog. Niggas out here getting money in our motherfucking spots, dog. No, we gonna handle that shit, alright? Man, this shit supposed to be handled, to you, man. I've been telling you this shit, man. Stop letting up on these niggas. This shit got to stop, man. Man, I hear that all. We gonna handle that shit, alright? Man, I know you keep telling me you hear that shit, nigga. You got two motherfucking ears for a reason, nigga. You better start listening. Don't nobody get money on my motherfucking block unless I'm getting some of that shit, dog. That's what it is. Get with it, get rolled up. Hey, yo, man, who the fuck is this nigga, man? I don't know who the fuck that is. Can I help you, nigga? You sure can, Pokey. Why the fuck you been fucking with my family for so long? Man, you gonna back the fuck up, nigga. Yeah, nigga. But I told you, motherfucker. Uh, Ty. Yo, what happened? Time safety dead, man. They killed time safety. Yeah. Everybody else dead, man. We gotta get out of here for the cops now. Look, man. I got money from the doji, too. I ain't get full value, but I got them there all of them. All right. All right, homie. Let's go ahead. Thank you for holding me down, Tuna Bug.